The head of investment and infrastructure in the office of the presidency, Dr. Jose Enzora Mojoba, was in the Limpopo province to fast track government's plans of investing in infrastructure. Government plans on investing 1 trillion rand in infrastructure over the next four years in the country, which includes the special economic zone. Dr. Romokopa met with investors, leaders in the industry and government stakeholders. The focus in Limpopo is really around uh, bulk water to support the mining industry, to support agriculture, but most significantly to support the Musina Makado SEZ. I'm sure you know it's one of the flagship projects in the, in the province and the country. And the biggest constraint there is water. Obviously the, the benefits are not going to be restricted to the SEZ itself. It will also help to meet the water deficit in Polokwane and the bigger catchment area. The Limpopo province aims to grow its economy by 3% over the next four years. The province's plans include industrializing the economy in the province, which is rich in minerals such as platinum. Our main pillars, obviously we have got key competitive sectors in the province. We have got mining, we have got tourism, we have got agriculture, and then the one sector that we want to really drive very hard is manufacturing. Because the, at the center of the growth of the province is that we want to industrialize the province. And this industrialization is centered around the need to add value in the country and also in the province. The chief executive officer of the Musina Makado Special Economic Zone is confident that the plans derived to provide the province with water will unlock ample opportunities in the province. We have conceptualized an idea of harvesting the run of flood water in the Limpopo River and um, put it into what we call an off-channel storage facility in a form of sand river, which is a naturally built uh, stream that will then be used as a storage facility. And our view is that um, the project has a great potential of uh, extracting sufficient amount of water uh, over 400 million cubic meters. And in our view, we believe that this project is a game changer by its nature. It's going to unlock a whole lot of opportunities and transform the spatial development of the areas of Musina and Makado.